Today we're going to be learning the dragon scale stitch. It's also called the alligator or crocodile scale stitch or crocodile stitch. Um, I'm using it to make this cute little bag and I just want to show you how to do this one stitch. I've done a couple of rows of double crochet just to get us started. So I'm going to make a series of V stitches and the V stitches are what you'll see underneath each one of these scales. So every other row of the dragon stitch is going to consist of V stitches. So that's where we're going to start. I'm going to start by chaining three. This is a chain two starter which counts as a double crochet and then I'm going to chain one more for a total of three and then I'm going to double crochet in the same stitch. And I've made a V. The next V will look a little more like a V. I'm going to skip two stitches and I'm going to double crochet in the next. Chain one and double crochet in the same stitch. So now you can see the V a little bit better. And we're going to do this all the way around, skipping two stitches and then double crochet in the next, chain one, and double crochet in that same stitch, making a V. Doing this all the way around, skip two, double crochet in the next, chain one, double crochet in the same stitch, And last one, we're going to double crochet, chain one, double crochet in the same stitch, and then we're going to slip stitch in that chain at the top of the original chain three to end this round. Now begins the crocodile stitch and what we're going to be doing is making half of our stitch on one half of the V's that we made and we'll make the other half of the stitch on the other part of the V that we made. So our V's have two legs to them. One, two. Each one of these scales has a total of ten double crochets there's five on each leg of the V. So for the first one we're going to chain two and we're going to count that as a double crochet. And then we're going to do a front post double crochet around the first leg of the first V. We're going to yarn over, go behind the first leg of the V pull up a loop, complete our double crochet. We have made two double crochets, but we started with a chain two, which counted. So one, two, three so far. We need two more, four, and five. So now you have this little extra piece here that is one half of your dragon scale. We're going to chain one and then we're going to make the other half of the dragon scale on the second leg of that V stitch. And what I like to do is just kind of pinch that leg stitch and hold it in place so that I can do a front post double crochet around that, five of them. So I'm yarning over, I'm going around this, the post, making a double crochet, and I need four more. So that's two, 
three. four and five and when you lay this down you'll see what you've created and that's a dragon scale we're going to make these all the way around we're going to skip the next V stitch the next set of double crochets with the chain one between them. We're going to skip those and we're going to go to the next. We're going to do a front post double crochet around the first post of the V-stitch. We're going to do five of those. One, two, three, four, five, Chain one, find the second post of that V stitch, pinch it to hold it in place so you can work with it, and five more front post double crochets around that post. One, two, three, four and five and you've made another dragon scale and you'll do this all the way around and when you get to the very end you just slip stitch to the beginning chain of the very first dragon scale. So now you've got an entire round. The next row is V stitches again, so you'll chain three, double crochet in the same stitch, making a V stitch. Then you'll make another V stitch in the middle of the next dragon scale, double crochet, chain one, double crochet. You'll make another V stitch in between the two dragon scales. Double crochet, chain one, double crochet in the same stitch and you'll do that all the way around a V stitch in the middle of each dragon scale and a V stitch in between each dragon scale and the round after that will be more dragon scales. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching.